Hello my friends and welcome back to my channel and welcome to this week's Sketch Sunday and day 24 of Christie's from Christie's Beautiful Life 30 Days of Sketches Series 14. This month is just flying by my friends isn't it? I, I think I'm saying that every every month but anyway here we are day 24 Sketch Sunday and I am using one of my Build-A-Page page kits. This is the one that I made with the Simple Stories, My Story. If you recall, I used that collection for my February, I think it was for my February collection obsession. And then I had a page kit sort of almost all ready to go didn't use it during Collection Obsession, brought it into my Build-A-Page. So I've got this started using this lovely coral uh, cardstock from Basil, which was in a Mercy Tiara Kits kit. And I've used some scraps from 12 by 12, this piece here, and then uh, some of the 6 by 8 that I have put with this kit. So in the sketch we have a 6 by 6 and this I used a 6 by 8 that I cut down. Uh, I also had a larger piece. I had a piece of this in 12 by 12. I forgot to bring it here or did I bring it here? No. That I had put in this page kit but that in the end I didn't I didn't use on this so I'll have that for another page. And then again, six by eight, six by eight, which is the rest or part of the rest of this piece of paper to do um, the layers here on the side. Now that today's sketch, oh, I forgot to tell you that. Today's sketch is by Tana Peterson and um, whatever information I can find for Tana will be down below. And if you look at the paper, layers or strips that she has on the side here. She did some fishtail banners. I decided to sort of leave them angular and to just use bits that sort of really went well with um, this floral. So the floral pattern, of course, when I put this page kit together was my jumping off point and then adding colors uh, that matched. I have this gorgeous, gorgeous photo of the gorgeous Julia. <laughs> Look at that face. Isn't that beautiful? Just relaxing and a little bit of a glass of wine and probably, I don't know, probably Joey, her dad or, or a friend just sort of made her look up or something and took a very, very natural, natural shot. And I love it. So I have a thin layer here. So my photo is sort of portrait. In the sketch, it's more landscape, and I think I've done a little bit more layering, two layers. I do like to do a very thin layer and a wider layer, which is something um, I got inspired from uh, my lovely friend Sarah, from Sarah Scraps eons ago. Now, so I have the photo, which in the sketch is centered. I have these scraps because I want to do the bit up here that is like in the sketch. Now, I'm thinking because I have these lovely big foam stickers and there's two ways I could go. I could go the way it is in the sketch with sort of maybe smile. Let's cut this out and see. Or I could also do maybe here the good life, which is then would be sort of on the side. So I was thinking I can do one of two things. I can definitely center the photo the way it is in the sketch. Now, my little corners stick off a little bit, but that's not so bad. And then I could put smile right here 
sort of the way it is in the sketch and that would sort of give me the title there that's just simply a photo of my lovely Julia smiling so that would work perfectly I'd also thought of shine but that would be more me telling her that she really shines in that photo rather than it being the title of a page in her album about her and then today and happy day those are a little bit too big uh, now I might bring in one of these butterflies and I'm definitely thinking of maybe bringing in the camera as an element up here so that is one way to go now because the photo is a little bit uh, longer and therefore sticks out a bit I was thinking I could bring it over here and then simply use this on the side here uh, the good life which could be fun and I think that could be nice then I would have to see what do I do here then I might put sort of like I've got this flare here oh actually I kind of like that love the good life Oh, my friends, I think that, I think I might like that. You know what? I think we're going to go that way. Or I could do, because we have no idea who these people are anyway. I could do the lovely watercolor camera that I always enjoy doing. And then have, oh my goodness, you know what? And then I've got some of these lovely little uh, Bramble Fox um hearts here which I could pop in there as well I like that okay I think that is the way we're going now you see it's so funny because when I sat down I had those two ideas but I was really leaning towards that but now that I think of it it sort of looks very heavy on Julia's head doesn't it so I think I'm liking this all right so let's get this Let's get this down, my friends. You know, sometimes talking it through with you, although you can't, you know, really answer me, but I keep saying, oh, my goodness me. Okay, hang on, friends. I'll be right back. Okay, so I brought this out. I received this, oh, my God, sometime last year, I think, as a freebie in one of my scrapbook.com orders, but I'm seeing a lot of people using this, so we'll have to see... whether I like it or not. I've been using the um, scrapbook.com, the smaller ones. I'm not getting along with my tape gun. I sort of have really given up on it for a little while. We'll, we'll see. Okay, so let's put that down. Okay, I like that. I really, really like that. And then she's sort of looking over. Oh, even better, she's actually sort of looking over at... Uh, the words okay so let's put that now you see there's a little bit of a crook here so I'm going to sort of position that where her elbow is so that it comes down here see I don't want it up there to take away from her elbow and then this will be lost so let's bring it in there and bring this up just a bit so that you see a little bit of that pink there we go the good life okay I like that then I think I like the now do I prefer like we could put love so love the good life or the what and I think I like the watercolor camera because then I can bring in some of these colors okay so let's do that you know, I love these watercolor camera flare from Halo Mac. I, I got these last year sometime, and I think I got two. I think I might have actually reordered them. I think in all I may have had three packs of these. There we go. Okay. Now, before I put the Bramble Fox goodies on here, let's get these up here so that I can get a little bit the same sort of feel and I'm going to bring this down a fair amount because I want it to mimic uh, what's on the side here and then I want to be able to get an embellishment on here so I think we'll do something like that There we 
go. Okay, so then if I want to do that, I want this to come sort of here. Let's see if I can do this fairly straight. That's not bad. And pop that there. Yeah, that's good. So that I have the same feel. And then bring this in. Let's bring that in the same way. go and then we'll see whether because my idea is I might want to put the camera up there or a floral we'll see the camera might be a little too big there we go let's cut this off okay so we have that on the side okay and I kind of like that all right so now let's see this camera is this camera a little bit smaller than this one I think it might be yes it is so what if we put that not this way but what if we put that here like that. Okay, so we have another camera like that. Now, I might put one of these little stars, this, this is me. Do I want a little butterfly or one of these florals? Would that be kind of fun? Put that here in the corner, another floral, maybe, there we go. And what I do here, the little things. I want to pop that here. The little things, there we go. Okay, put that down here. Then do I want maybe a floral up there? There we go. Put that put the little things. I'm not sure I really need that actually. Let's not, I think, because we already have, you know, the good life. The love is there. Okay, I do think I want to put this here. Let's get a little bit of liquid glue out, and we'll pop that. And then I think we'll put a turquoise one. Let's pop that here. And then would I want one of these up here? Yeah, I think that, or do I want one of the smaller ones? That's the same size. Maybe a smaller one. Yep. Let's get that. go okay then I think I might want to put oh what did I go pulling on the floor there my friends I can't see it so I'll I'll get it afterwards maybe do I want this I think is too big I'm not sure oh maybe this little 
Maybe this little yellow, or does that all of a sudden introduce a color that we don't need? Yeah, sort of does. So maybe... Don't want that. Hmm, how about if we put maybe just this tiny one? No, don't want, don't feel that either. You know what? I don't think I need anything up there. I, I just, I think I'm trying to replicate, but quite honestly, I don't, I don't really need it. Yeah, it's just going to make everything a little bit too heavy unless I pop maybe this little heart. Would I pop this little heart right here? No. Again. Ah, there we go. How about there? Don't need it. Don't need it, my friends. Okay. So let's just pop all of that there. And I guess the very last thing I'm wondering is, is it maybe a little heavy over on this side? And should I pop something, a little something over here? You see, I don't, no, I don't think it needs it. You know what, my friends? I think I am faffing for no reason, and I'm looking to put more on here than is needed. So I think we are going to stop there. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for all the, the likes, the comments, for all of the lovely, lovely support. Uh, I so enjoy. I just do this for fun. I enjoy sharing with you, um, and, and I hope... I hope you get a little bit of inspiration. For sure, you're getting tons and tons of inspiration with 30 Days of Sketches Series 14 this month. The playlist, as it always is, is down below. My Sketch Sunday friends that are playing along, of course, are down below as well. And uh, don't forget, hashtag 30DSCBL14 to find us or for us to find you. And I will be back, hopefully, hopefully I will be back tomorrow with Christmas in March, my friends, because that is where we're at tomorrow. And I will see you back here very, very soon. Thanks for being with me. Bye for now.